Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing this purple and pink inspired look, I guess. I don't really know. This was actually my look for Valentine's Day um, that I never finished because children. So I am using the Huda Beauty Mob Obsessions palette for my eyeshadow today. So if you wanna see how I did this look, keep on watching. First I'm going to prime and use foundation, and then I will be right back. It's the same steps, so you know, it gets kind of boring seeing it a million times, so we'll be right back. For concealer today, I am using the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Concealer in 01. Now with some Cody Airspun powder, I'm just going to set my concealer and the rest of my face. For today's eyeshadow, I'm using the Mob Obsessions by Huda Beauty, this little mini guy right here. And the colors are so beautiful, they're so pigmented, and they blend out super, super nice. So I really like this little mini palette here. I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush, and I'm going to go into this um, bone shade here. I'm going to take this and just sweep it all over my lids. And I'm going to apply this to my crease. I'm just going to work on blending it. You're looking out the window? What do you see? I see the cars. You see the cars? See the cars drive by? Look, two pretty houses. Hey, look at the houses. Yeah? Look at the pictures of birds. I'm going to take this really deep mauve color here. I'm going to apply this a little bit onto my crease. Going back in with that first brush, and I am just blending the two shades together. Next, I'm taking this dark red shade here. I'm going to focus this on the outer corner. I'm just going to press it in there. I'm going to take some concealer, and I'm just going to carve out where I want to put this next shade. I'm going to take your time with this too. I feel like I'm always trying to like rush this part and then it always looks like a mess. Next I'm going to go in with this very light pink shade, this metallic shade here. I'm going to pack this color over top the concealer. I actually went ahead and sprayed some Fix Plus on it. I kind of want that extra pop of this metallic shade. And I'm just going to blend the edges together. A bit of this shade here. And I'm just going to apply this to the edges where the metallic pink meets that kind of reddish color. Next I'm gonna take that red shade again, and I'm going to apply this to my lower lash line. Kind of smoking it out a little bit with that first bone shade that we used. It's not as harsh. I'm going to apply some liner and I'll be right back. Um, so I applied my lashes and my liner. And I don't think I've ever applied lashes so wrong in my life. They just, I don't know what I did with the application. But anyway, they're on there. They're not stabbing me in the eye, so perfect. For my lower lash line, I also applied a little bit more of that dark purple shade that we originally used on the lower lash line. And then I applied some mascara. For contour today, I'm going to use this Profusion Contour Kit. And I'm going to take my trusty 
contour slash highlighting brush and I'm going to go in with the lightest brown shade which is this one here. We are going to use this um, Milani Romantic Rose Powder Blush that I just love the smell of so much. I'm going to take a little bit of my loose powder, there are the words, and just carve out my cheekbones. Moving on to highlighter, and I have this Radiant Glow Highlighter in 24 Karat Magic by IBY Beauty. It's in its little cute package, and that is what that looks like inside. I'm just going to apply that. For lipstick, I think I'm going to use this MTM Flow liquid lipstick. I think that's what that is. Um, this is in the color Retro, so I'm going to give this a shot. So that is a very super drying lipstick. Mm. It kind of dries down sticky. And when I do that, it kind of like lifts up and looks gross. So I'm going to apply this. Let's see. So I applied a little bit of Trinket from Sugar Pill over top to kind of try to salvage what was there. All right, so this is the finished look, you guys. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are not already at 500 subscribers and you're almost halfway there. I will be doing a giveaway, so make sure you share it with your friends as well. All right, guys, I will see you all in the next video. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye.